For centuries, humanity has gazed at the stars, wondering what lies beyond. From ancient astronomers to modern scientists, our collective curiosity has always pulled us upward. Among all distant worlds, Mars has become more than just a planet. It's a symbol of survival, imagination, and the next great chapter in our story. The journey to Mars isn't a single leap, but countless steps of experimentation, failure, and progress. Today, SpaceX leads these steps, turning impossible visions into real milestones. With Starship Flight 10, the dream of reaching another planet feels less like science fiction and more like a destination within reach. For the first time, becoming a multi-planetary species looks not only possible, but increasingly feasible. The human itch for the heavens. From the moment our ancestors looked up, the stars have been a source of mystery and possibility. That same restless energy that pushed early explorers to cross oceans into the unknown is now propelling rockets beyond Earth's atmosphere. Curiosity isn't just a trait we carry, it is our identity. Space became the new ocean in the 20th century. When Sputnik launched in 1957, it shifted our perspective, proving we could place a piece of ourselves beyond the sky. This was followed by Yuri Gagarin orbiting Earth, and in 1969, Neil Armstrong's historic first step on the moon. That single step culminated centuries of dreams, but also ignited a new hunger for what lay beyond. For many, Mars became the answer. The red planet has always intrigued us, appearing close enough to feel within reach, yet distant enough to symbolize the unknown. Its landscape, marked by polar ice caps and dust storms, holds a mirror to our desire to seek life beyond our own. But the pull of Mars is more than scientific. It speaks to survival. Earth is fragile. The idea of another planet providing a second home stirs both imagination and urgency. Colonizing Mars could ensure humanity's continuation, a vision that keeps explorers and engineers working tirelessly. The heavens call to us, reminding us that limits are temporary and that curiosity has always been the spark of progress. Among all the worlds in our solar system, Mars holds a special place. It's the planet that most symbolizes the next great step in exploration. But why are we so captivated by it? Scientifically, Mars is a time capsule of planetary history. Billions of years ago, evidence suggests Mars had rivers, lakes, and oceans. If water once flowed freely, could life have emerged there too? This question has driven generations of scientists. Robotic rovers have searched the red soil for signs of past life, and each discovery fuels the idea that Mars might have once been a living world. Confirming that life arose independently on another planet would revolutionize our understanding of biology, suggesting that life is a common thread in the universe. There are also practical reasons. Mars is the most reachable planet for human exploration. It has a solid surface, a day length similar to Earth's, and resources that could be used for survival. Its atmosphere, though thin, is rich in carbon dioxide, and water ice is buried beneath its poles. Future colonists could use these resources to create breathable air, drinking water, and even rocket fuel. In this way, Mars could be a laboratory for learning to live beyond Earth. Finally, there's the matter of survival. Earth is our only home but it's not indestructible. A self-sustaining colony on Mars would act as a risk mitigation step for humanity, ensuring that no single disaster on Earth could wipe out our species. It's a sobering thought, but a powerful motivator. Beyond science and survival, Mars inspires us as a cultural frontier. To set foot there would fulfill centuries of longing. Why Mars? Because it's close enough to reach challenging enough to inspire, and meaningful enough to redefine what it means to be human. It's a planet that offers discovery and serious challenges. Turning the dream of Mars into reality requires immense ambition and engineering genius. SpaceX, founded by Elon Musk, has become the leading force in this transformation. Its mission is to make humanity a multi-planetary species, and its ultimate goal is to create a transportation system that can send large numbers of people and cargo to Mars safely and affordably. The cornerstone of this vision is Starship, a fully reusable rocket system composed of the Super Heavy Booster and the Starship Upper Stage. Together, they are the most powerful launch vehicle ever built. Reusability is the key, as it drastically lowers the cost of accessing space. Every time a booster or starship is flown again, the dream of affordable interplanetary travel gets closer. Starship is designed specifically for Mars. 
Its engines run on methane and liquid oxygen, a fuel combination that can be produced on Mars from local resources. This concept, known as in-situ resource utilization, is a game changer, allowing future colonists to refuel for the journey home. The spacecraft is also enormous, capable of carrying over a hundred tons of cargo or dozens of passengers, making it the only vehicle in development with the potential to establish a sustained human presence on Mars. SpaceX's approach is unusual in its embrace of rapid iteration. Early prototypes were built quickly, tested aggressively, and often failed spectacularly. However, each failure was treated as a lesson, not a setback. This philosophy of failing fast and learning faster allows the company to compress decades of aerospace development into just a few years. Unlike secretive programs of the past, SpaceX's tests are public, live-streamed, and widely viewed. This transparency has made the dream of Mars tangible, showing that risk, innovation, and persistence can make the impossible possible. Space exploration is a high-stakes endeavor, and for SpaceX, this reality has been a defining part of the Starship program. The journey has been marked by dramatic moments, broadcast to the world, creating a story of resilience and relentless pursuit. Early Starship prototypes were built to test the limits of design and performance. Many of these tests ended in spectacular explosions. To a casual observer, it might have looked like chaos, but to engineers, it was progress. Every explosion produced invaluable data that was used to improve the next version. Each setback brought the team closer to its goal. A memorable early flight, Starship SN8, soared to a high altitude and performed complex maneuvers perfectly before a fuel issue caused a fiery crash upon landing. While it looked like a failure, engineers were ecstatic. The flight proved the vehicle's core design and capabilities worked. It was a failure in execution, but a massive success in proof of concept. Subsequent prototypes built upon these lessons. Starship SN10 achieved a historic landing, even though it exploded moments later. Through this constant trial and error, SpaceX transformed public failure into a powerful learning laboratory. This willingness to fail in the open is unusual. It allows the public to witness innovation in real time, making successes feel monumental and failures feel like instructive steps forward. Through this drama, the narrative was clear. Failure is not the opposite of success. It is part of the process. By Flight 10, this philosophy had paid off. The program's history of public setbacks became its foundation of confidence, proving that SpaceX can learn, adapt, and innovate faster than any aerospace program before it. After a long series of lessons learned from both failure and incremental improvements, Starship Flight 10 marked a major turning point in SpaceX's journey to Mars. This flight captured global attention, not just for its technical achievements, but for what it symbolized, the dream of interplanetary travel is becoming a reality. Lifting off from Starbase, Texas, the vehicle executed a series of complex maneuvers flawlessly. The engines performed as planned, the upper stage tested payload deployment mechanisms, and upgraded heat shield tiles were put to the test, all crucial steps for future missions. One of the most striking successes of Flight 10 was its execution of a controlled descent. Both the booster and the upper stage demonstrated they could survive the intense heat of re-entry long enough for recovery operations. While not every element was perfect, the mission proved that the vehicle's design and guidance systems were approaching the reliability needed for operational flights. It was a culmination of years of perseverance and ingenuity. For the aerospace industry and NASA, which collaborates with SpaceX on lunar missions, Flight 10 was a powerful demonstration of the company's capability to handle large-scale space transport. It confirmed that reusable heavy lift systems are no longer a distant dream, but an approaching reality. More than a technical success, Flight 10 carries immense symbolic weight. It signals that regular launches to orbit and beyond are on the horizon. For anyone who has dreamed of walking on Mars, Flight 10 is a moment of hope and a clear sign that those dreams are now grounded in tangible progress. Starship Flight 10 is more than just an engineering milestone. It is a signal that humanity is inching closer to becoming a multi-planetary species. The mission's success in demonstrating complex maneuvers and recovery procedures reduces uncertainty and builds confidence for the critical next steps, crewed missions, 
lunar landings, and ultimately, the journey to Mars. In the short term, this success accelerates SpaceX's other projects and strengthens its partnership with NASA. Flight 10 proves that SpaceX's systems can handle the heavy lift operations needed for ambitious goals in Earth orbit and deep space. The long-term implications are even more profound. Each successful flight brings us closer to establishing a permanent human presence on another planet. Starship could eventually transport the people and supplies needed to build the first Martian outpost, where we can learn to survive in a harsh new world. However, it's important to remain realistic. Mars is still far away, and long-duration space travel presents immense challenges, from radiation exposure to life support. While Flight 10 reduces technical uncertainty, many more demonstrations are required to prove Starship is safe and reliable enough for humans. A sustainable colony on Mars will take decades to achieve. Even so, Flight 10 is a powerful reminder of what is possible when ambition is paired with persistence. It gives us hope that exploration and discovery are achievable goals. Each success brings the dream of standing on Martian soil closer to reality. As we watch these rockets test the limits of technology, we are reminded of our own potential. The journey to Mars is just beginning, and with each milestone, it becomes more attainable. If we can dream of reaching another planet and see progress towards that goal, it raises a simple question for each of us. How far are we willing to go to turn our own imagination into reality? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more insights into the future of space exploration. Your support helps us bring you more captivating stories like this. Thank you for watching.